Hey everybody, Chip Wooten, the DIY Outdoorsman here with you. It is opening day in Tennessee. Well, actually it's just opening day on Real Foot Lake and it's a really cool spot. We did a little hunting this morning. I got a little bit of footage I'm gonna show you here in a second. And um, day one didn't really turn out quite the way we thought. Uh, the blind we had was, um, how do I say this? Not the nicest one I've hunted in. And uh, it had a little lean going to it. So uh, we stayed relatively dry. Fortunately, we all had on knee-high boots, but you'll understand a little bit more in a minute. But anyways, um, stay tuned with us. Hopefully we're gonna have some more action, a little bit of action from uh, Gray's Camp where we're staying up here at uh, Real Foot Lake. Seven, eight, seven people out there. Let's see if Shannon ain't here. Fellas, they are talking what they say about us. Mm -hmm. They're saying, damn, that fucking blind about to flip. <laughs> what the hell was that, You always have open and day adventures. Huh? I said, you always have open and day adventures. <laughs> You always hear about guys kicking the water in Arkansas in the timber. We're just going to yeah. kick kick water in our blind here. gyms east end liquors yep that's the whole store i can zoom in pretty good on my bed i can't zoom in that far oh my gosh i don't know if you can tell how many ducks there are it's like a swarm of bees out there Yeah, how do we lease this field? Her home. Thank God. Oh, my God. Whenever you come to Real Foot Lake, you got to eat at Boyette's. Man, all you can eat, catfish, chicken, Oof. best in the lake. Boyette's, check it out when you're here. All right, here we are in the famous Boyette's restaurant. Let's go in, let's eat some catfish.
It says catfish for the lemonade, catfish wine. Okay. Well, there's some right here by me. Oh, okay. I'll, you might, I'll, I'll grab some more too. Thank you. Anybody else need another beer too? No, I'm good, honey. Thank I'm okay. you. Go. Okay, just one more Here, I'll take it. Hi. Hello. Seven o'clock. I'm setting my damn fire all day. <laughs> Well, we're calling it a wrap here. It's November 10th here in Real Foot Lake. It's early season. We only got two weeks left till regular season starts. Thanksgiving, turkey time. That's when it really gets started. But uh, got Adam here with me. Morning, folks. It's a beautiful day out here. Just <clears throat> ducks just aren't really wanting to do it today. They, we watched about five ten thousand pile into a field last night and they got big old full bellies of rice and it's only about 48 degrees outside so they're off loafing somewhere it's just not here convince the other guys to go pick up all the decoys so that's not too bad but uh just not sure how we're gonna get out of here because that's our boat hide yeah that joker is completely collapsed so um i'm thinking i'm probably gonna have to lift adam out of here what do y'all think yeah. <laughs> I think I'm going to have to hold you by your little toe and dangle you over the further blind. I think you might be right. <laughs> well, we are officially pulling out of Gray's camp. I had a fun time this weekend. We got to hunt, see some guys I haven't seen since last duck season, and had a good time. But now I'm ready to get home and love them, my babies, and uh, ready for the regular duck season to get here. It was, it was fun to get out. Um, we had a rough time with the blind we were hunting out of, but uh, we did have a good time and some good camaraderie. And we're really just getting excited about what's to come. Uh, it's looking like things could shape up pretty good here in Tennessee this year, especially for the places that have good crops. So hopefully I got some more videos to show you here soon. Now I got about a three hour drive to get back to the house, but uh, we'll catch you next time on DIY Outdoorsman. Thanks.